सो हेलो गाइज आई एम कुमार के योर फेवरेट टीचर फॉर डी एस ए प्लस ओ ए प्लस सी पी प्रीवियसली आई वर्क दैट अमेजॉन एंड मीडिया डॉट नेट एज अ सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर एंड नाउ आई स्पेंड ऑल ऑफ माई टाइम इन मोस्ट ऑफ माई टाइम इन गाइडिंग एंड ट्रेनिंग लवली स्टूडेंट्स लाइक यू सो गाइज द फर्स्ट थिंग विच आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर इज दैट आई हैव गॉट ऑल इंडिया रैंक वन फिफ्टी एट इन टी सी एस कोडविटा सीजन नाइन विच वॉज कंडक्टेड इन and in the second round of tcs code beta i just got all india rank 115 okay so i am very very experienced with giving the coding rounds of tcs code beta i have given them two to three times in my second year third year and fourth year okay now this video is going to be very very important for you people okay specifically the people from tier 3 tier 4 colleges because i was myself from the tier 3 tier 4 college and i graduated during covid time in 2020 to 2020 and 2021 so i did not get any placement from my college right so the only way to get my first job was to perform very well in tcs code vita because if you perform well in tcs code vita you get the interview opportunity from there so because i scored these great ranks i got the interview opportunity and i did crack the digital offer at that time digital offer used to be the maximum offer they gave and now i am training my students since a long time right so like I also cracked Amazon and Mia dot net offer, so I did not have to go with TCS finally. But it's very very useful for many many people. Okay, like many of my students have gotten top top all India ranks in TCS code beta in the past, and they also got the digital offer and the innovation, uh, you know, innovator offer of seven LPA and eleven LPA. So I am going to exactly explain you how to prepare for their coding questions and which mistakes you should not do, so that you can get the best possible rank. And because of that boy's best possible rank, you will get the interviews. Later on, I will also explain you how to prepare for the TCS interview. Okay, I want you guys to get a seven LP and eleven LP offer. So uh, let's go straight to the video and Ram Ram. Name of God Ram Ram. I am going to provide immense value to you with this video. I have done the hard work and collected all the previous year coding questions, fifteen to thirty questions we have, and I am going to provide you the codes and video solution also. So write in the comment code and video solution. Then I will be uploading the video solutions also of the previous year. Okay. Before I start the video or in the start of the video, I want to clear it up that I have all India rank one fifty eight out of one lakh people in TCS code with a first round. In the second round, I got even better rank. I was astonished by looking at looking at that. All India rank one hundred and fifteen. Now, what kind of package you get from TCS entirely depends upon first thing your rank and second thing your interview performance. Okay, so I got seven LPA TCS digital offer. That time, this was the highest offer TCS generally used to give to TCS code beta candidates. Okay, you can see my interview shortlist mail. Once you Crack the round after few months. Like if you are a 2026 batch student in October, November, December, via your college or directly TCS is going to mail you for the interview. Clear? Next thing is about the second round mail. If you pass the first round, you will get second round mail like this as I got in the past. Okay? How to apply, guys? Quickly apply here. It's it's very important. I want you to quickly apply. Okay? So, guys, who can apply? well all the people who are in 2000 who are 2025 graduates 26 graduates 27 graduates or 2028 graduates are eligible to participate for whom is it most important the tier 3 four college students who are in third year and fourth year if you are a third year person you get a good rank in this contest next year you will be getting the direct interview opportunity with tcs with high chances or at least you will be ready to score good rank next year because you have the experience of this year If you are a fourth year candidate and you get less than eight thousand, ten thousand rank, for sure you are going to get interviews in two to three months only. So no matter how bad your college is, no matter how bad the things are going on in life, just score good in this coding test and get seven LPA to eleven LPA. That's it. TCS offer two high paying profiles. One is digital offer of seven LPA, and the other other is innovator profile of eleven LPA. Multiple of my students like fifty eight. to 68 students of mine i remember like 50 to 60 exact number i don't know they have cracked like digital and uh, innovator offer last year so i have guided them thoroughly and whatever result they gave me and the analysis have made it clear totally how to guide you people as well for the same so you can generate similar kind of results okay guys there are many 2025 grads who don't have any job 
please immediately apply this you will immediately get an interview scheduled after scoring good and then uh, everything will be very very easy for you okay like one of the screenshots i want to show like how my student got a good rank like he is my student of dsa plus oa plus cb training cohort he was a beginner in dsa in just one month of high level dsa training by me he got 2605 global rank in tcs code beta and then he got the interviews also also of the tcs digital offer and all those things clear we call it as tcs digital offer cadre okay so there are three rounds first round is the most important guys second round third round you only have to aim for it if you are looking for the global recognition and our top rank in your resume or else just focus on the first round get a good rank and then get the interview from tcs that's it to get the interview offer of 7 lpa guys you need to get somewhere around 2000 to 4000 rank and to get a innovator profile type of interview you need to get like less than equal to 1000 rank okay the interviews will be common for all but generally the final result after the interview will be depending upon your interview performance and the rank if the rank is very bad and even if you perform good in the interview you are not going to get 7 lpa 11 lpa okay and uh, for ninja profiles you know not the 3.5 lpa ones <laughs> but for some people this is important so you need to get like 8000 to 10000 max limit to be safe these days 15000 20000 rank is also good enough but you need to be safe right so 8000 to 10000 in general 1 lakh people generally give the exam but this year we are expecting like 2 lakh people might be giving the tcs code beta okay now we will only be discussing about the first round because 99% of the people are only focused on first round crack it and get the interview and get the job done right so guys there are going to be like in some years there were six problems okay for six hours and in some other years there were eight problems okay there were eight problems for six hours so there will be a six hour coding test window given to you okay there will be three to four different problem sets made for different different zones so guys with the name of god ram ram you should understand that tcs is going to have three to four zone like z1 z2 like this okay three four zones one zone can be mumbai pune maharashtra zone then north indian zone and things like that kolkata zone things like that so for each of the zone na the date and timing will be little different okay if if someone is having the tcs like zone one guys might have code beta on 9 september then zone two on 10 september and like that like that okay but generally in two days all the four zones get their test completely done and each problem set generally include six problems okay or maximum eight problems so in total there are going to be like 20 to 30 different coding questions of appearing in different different problem sets so it's not sure that you are going to get the same coding question as the person uh, getting the other problem set okay but the people giving the exam in your own zone like i i know this from personal experience let's say you are from zone 1 and you are someone else is also from zone 1 they are also giving the test you are also giving the test then 50% of coding questions might be similar this has happened many times in the past that's why i'm able to give you the secret knowledge here okay so knowledge is very important i have told you everything what to do how to do now let's go next guys please avoid plagiarism many people are going to use telegram and ai but the problem is that Each year, sixty to eighty percent candidates get rejected even after passing the coding questions due to plagiarism. Like TC has, like in my year, I remember they rejected sixty thousand to eighty thousand people out of one lakh people because all of them just copy pasted codes from Telegram. And now AI is also there. So if you copy paste the codes, you are cooked. Okay, I don't want you to get cooked. So what I want to tell you is that you should not be cooked or screwed. So. i want you to understand that no matter what kind of help you are trying to use or you are trying to increase the score try to understand the problem and after understanding the problem try to understand the answer or whatever answer you are getting or you are able to uh, get the answer on your own and then write the code yourself if you use telegram ai you are going to fail and the 7 7 lpa to 11 lpa will go away from your hands okay please have faith in god good health good mindset now these basic things are clear to you but you might be thinking sir how much do we need to score see after the plagiarism test is done you need to solve minimum 1 to 1.5 coding questions okay to get the interview for ninja type of role but to be safe you should try for two then you are fully safe 
for digital kind of offer you need to solve three to four problems for digital kind of pop offer okay and for top ranks like in top 100 200 300 like i got you need to solve four plus problems correctly without any kind of cheating okay now how to prepare for it well 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 i have collected the full list of all the coding questions asked in 2017 2018 19 20 21 22 23 24 2024 in this document so just go through this document practice all those questions and you are done but in general please know that they are going to ask you hard unseen dsa questions dsa plus oa plus cp type problems okay so just doing standard dsa sheets is not going to suffice you need to practice story based you know hard and seen story based problems story based dsa plus oa plus cp type problems okay so just let me fix it now like these are all the links you guys can go through it and the questions older than 2024 you guys can find it here okay first i am going to open each of the previous year question and we are going to analyze it and then i will just end this video but later on like by tomorrow in this document i will add the actual resources from where you should prepare guys from where you should prepare which playlists of oacp you should watch how can you improve yourself so that you have maximum chances of qualifying so if you want the perfect perfect resources and preparation material make sure you comment that also in the comment section i will add it in this document only and this document will surely be available in the description of this youtube video okay so guys this was the first like there were 3 to 4 zones so there were 18 to 25 different problems asked okay so let's start deciphering each and every problem so string obsession problem guys this was a pretty hard problem asked on hard and seen problem asked on string and dynamic programming then let's check the next problem guys this was form form alternating string well this was a problem which was based on basic string concepts plus you just need to do some observation and some implementation little greedy if you really want but it's not actually greedy but little bit is there next question which was asked last year it is uh, desert queen guys this is a matrix type problem okay so grid matrix plus bfs plus dfs plus memoization you have to apply you want video solutions for it let me know in the in the youtube chat or what we call it as comments okay generally i teach a lot in google meeting na so i have this habit of saying that right in the chat or google chat so you see my name has been used kumar k karan kumar okay so busy day sale busy day sale this problem was asked in tcs code vita last year and it involves greedy plus observation concept okay again grid matrix plus bfs dfs problem has been asked which is the arrange map problem you guys can see which which topic is getting repeated the most right again a grid plus geometry problem the name is find the pairs oh my god again a string db problem asked last year the string puzzle ajanta book lover right become a coding lover again a string plus observation plus implementation problem asked okay observation plus implementation problem has been asked loop master last year and then again matrix rotation guys matrix string and db problem is getting asked again 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 a grid matrix db problem like grid and matrix is the same thing right see no one is going to do such deep analysis for you i have brought each and every coding question of the last year so you guys can pass and you can get the exact idea what to do how to do very very serious i am about you because i myself was not from a good college so it took me lots of time to improve myself no one was there to help me like this i am helping you use it properly i want you to sleep happily knowing in your heart that you did the hard work and you did the study and you are passing the oa and interview that's all i want and i want you to do this with those things legally folded area this is again very very important problem folded area this was again based on grid matrix plus 2d geometry okay like you guys can check our new platform also codelegal.in 
if you practice here your dso ecb skills will improve a lot and here no kind of cheating is possible so it's going to be launched in few weeks you can go through this website link as well now there are many more links like if you want to quickly prepare in small time you can do my free warm up course of dsa plus oa plus ep this link i will just attach it here so just let me write here um yeah best best free warm up dsa you need to do it for tcs code beta preparation dsa plus oa plus ep course in the country by kumar ke okay so these things are clear now if i try to show you some more problems well this problem right string puzzle problem we have went through it matrix rotation count press we went through it folded area problem guys again based on two dimensional geometry and grid matrix concept now yeah clock problem i remember clock problem like every 2 3 years they give some clock problem it's totally dependent on maths and angle calculations and applying the implementation a similar problem i remember was asked in google code jam also in the past this problem maximum area this is again guys a grid matrix plus 2d geometry problem can you see grid matrix 2d geometry these are the concepts they keep on repeating every time guys so you better be careful okay now let's go from down to up so many coding questions are there this problem was also last uh, asked last year in some problem set sofa problem again a string plus dynamic programming on matrix problem you can see matrix grid plus dp okay now if i try to show you this mirror maze problem guys again grid matrix grid dp then flight optimization a very good problem on dystra plus graph concepts okay again a problem arav and arjun on 2d geometry and grid and matrix plus dp like it's just so interesting man yeah size mini project this is a basic problem on strings and observation you can do it plus implementation and this is a problem where you have to use very complicated data structures and do some string manipulation plus hashing plus implementation okay so this problem is there for you frankenstein then guys this problem snakes and ladder is based on backtracking grid and dp all these problems are totally new you i am sure you have not seen the, them anywhere else before so you need to develop that intuition to solve hard and seen dsa ocp problems okay so after all this what analysis is coming up the analysis is coming up that at least one or two questions are going to be straight forward okay like uh, just uh, like the final analysis i'm going to add the preparation material also in some time the final analysis is and see how true it comes one to two coding questions will be straight forward they will be straight forward based on based on basic array or string plus implementation plus observation plus greedy concepts okay like the other 4 to 6 questions 4 to 6 questions are going to involve what hard level dp or dp on matrix plus backtracking plus backtracking plus two dimensional geometry concepts of dsa which you will not find in standard dsa sheets 2d 2d geometry plus some geometrical algorithms like scan line algo okay please know that when i'm saying 2d geometry you have to understand how to you know solve the dsa problems of 1d geometry 2d geometry and the coordinate points and scan line algorithms and the greedy concepts okay so obviously greedy will be mixed here in different ways plus hard level bfs dfs high level bfs dfs on matrix so this is what the observation of the previous year tells us okay so make sure you go through this website guys with acqna.in it's very important for you go through each topic watch all the videos write the code understand them deeply and make sure you comment at the bottom that you want the full resources for the preparation of all these topics and you want the video solutions 
then I will make it up for you and add in this document only or I'll upload the another YouTube video for it. Hopefully you guys learned a lot. With the name of God, Ram Ram, be happy and successful. Ram Ram.